Aquarius, how are you doing? <laughs> Welcome into your daily reading with me, Deborah. Let's get let's get in here and see what's going on in your reading. We're going to be getting out one of the cards of autumn messages from your spirit guides with regards to what's in your energy, what's going on around you, and what you do not see coming. So let's get in here and have a look and see what's happening. What's in your energy right now? Leo rocking up there. We've got a strength card. Very nice. What's around you? King of Wands. All right. What you do not see coming? Six of Cups. Wow. So <laughs> let's go here. Um, there's so much coming through in your reading. First of all, we got the, the Strength card coming up. This is Leo's energy. I feel like that's where you're standing right now. You're feeling very strong in your life. You're feeling very confident. You want to go for something. You might have plans. But at the same time, you know, she's standing with, she's a lion, but she's standing with a little lamb over there. So I feel like you are being very cautious, very generous around people around you, not just tramping over people's feelings. I feel like you're being a very, uh, like a strong person, but also a, being a good person, which is very nice. There is a decision that you've made here in your past. Interestingly enough, that is King of Wands. There is a lion there and there's a lion there. So you were very brave and you took control in your life in some kind of way here with the King of Wands. You took control. You might have made a decision and you said, you know what, I'm going to go for something here. I'm not going to stand back. I'm not going to be um, in the background here. I'm not going to be um, just letting my life move away with me i'm gonna go for what i want and i feel like there's a lot of confidence coming in from there because with this it leads to the six of cups here i want to read the energy under the deck i'm very curious the nine of swords you are changing your life here the six of cups here this goes back to like memories it goes back to things that you've experienced from childhood things that you experienced the way they were before these are good memories so it's almost like your decision to change your life here it's somehow taking you full circle back around to your past. It's almost like you're recreating the life that you lost. Wow. Yes. Look at the Nine of Swords. The Nine of Swords is a card of worry, a card of pain, a card of uh, things not being okay. Now we're looking at the energy of everything here under this deck. Okay. The card of pain, a card of worry. Of worry. This is like you got no power. It's like you're crying there. You don't know what to do. And then all of a sudden you stood up and said, you know what? I have a lion inside of me. I'm not going to cry like this. I'm taking back my power. I'm going to do what I need to do. I'm going to stand up strong. I'm going to go for what I need. And this takes you back to the life that you had before. And this is the decisions you've made. And what you don't see, there's a place that you were happiest in your past year. You're getting your life back to that place. That is so beautiful. Like a place of safety, a place of nostalgia, a place of where things were good. You know, you're getting your life back there. I'm very happy, Aquarius. That's beautiful. If that does help you and you want to catch more content, you can subscribe. Otherwise, you can check out a long-form content video, which will be over there, much more in-depth. Go in there and see which one of them calls to you. And then uh, pick a card reading over there on my new channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. Bye.